Hey, what's up, Strivers Money Crew? Are you tired of working that 9 to 5 and watching your hard-earned cash just sit in the bank? Yeah, me too. So today, we're diving into the world of investing. No, not just dabbling, but actually learning how to invest like a pro. Stay tuned, because we're about to reveal some secret investing tips that'll have you living the life of your dreams in no time. But before we start rolling in the dough, you know the drill. Hit that like button and subscribe to Strivers Money for more videos that'll help you build wealth and achieve financial freedom. All right, let's dive in. Number one, the basics of investing. First things first, let's cover some basic investing principles. This might be common knowledge for some of you, but hey, we've all got to start somewhere, right? So, what is investing? In a nutshell, investing means putting your money to work for you. Instead of just letting it sit in a savings account, you're using it to buy assets that can generate income or increase in value over time. There are various types of investments, such as stocks, bonds, mutual funds, real estate, and even cryptocurrencies. But don't worry, we'll touch on each of these later on. Now, let's talk about risk. All investments come with some level of risk, and generally, higher potential returns come with higher risks. So it's essential to strike a balance between risk and reward based on your individual tolerance and financial goals. Number 2. Establishing your investment goals and strategy now that we've covered the basics, it's time to figure out what you want to achieve with your investments. Are you saving for retirement, building an emergency fund, or funding that extravagant world tour you've always dreamed of? It's crucial to set clear and realistic goals before jumping in. Once you've got your goals in mind, it's time to develop a strategy. One popular approach is called dollar cost averaging, where you invest a fixed amount of money at regular intervals, regardless of market conditions. This way, you'll be buying more shares when prices are low, and fewer shares when prices are high, potentially reducing the overall risk. Another essential aspect of investing is diversification, spreading your money across various types of investments to minimize risk. Remember the old saying, don't put all your eggs in one basket? Yeah, that applies here, too. Number 3. Choosing your investments All right, now that you've got your goals and strategy locked down, let's talk about how to choose your investments. Stocks represent ownership in a company and can offer significant growth potential but they can also be volatile, so make sure you're ready for those ups and downs. Bonds are loans you make to companies or governments. They generally offer lower returns than stocks, but they can be a more stable and predictable source of income. Mutual funds and exchange-traded funds ETFs, allow you to invest in a diversified portfolio of stocks or bonds with a single purchase. These can be a great way to dip your toes into investing without having to pick individual stocks or bonds. And let's not forget about real estate, which can provide both income and potential appreciation. Investing in real estate can be done through buying physical properties or investing in real estate investment funds, REITs, which are like mutual funds for real estate. Finally, there are alternative investments like cryptocurrencies, which can be a high-risk, high-reward option. If you're interested in this, make sure to do your research and only invest what you're willing to lose. Number 4. Getting started with investing Okay, you've got your goals, your strategy, and you know what types of investments you're interested in. Now, how do you actually start investing? First, you'll need to open a brokerage account. There are many online platforms available, some with low fees and even commission-free trades. Do your research and choose the one that fits your needs best. Next, deposit some money into your account and start building your portfolio. Remember, it's essential to stick to your strategy and stay diversified. Finally, be patient and consistent. Investing is a long-term game, and trying to time the market or chase short-term gains can lead to significant losses. Keep an eye on your portfolio, but don't let emotions drive your decisions. Here you got the beginner's guide to start investing and making your money work for you. Remember, the sooner you start, the more time your investments have to grow. So don't wait any longer. Now, it's time to take action and check out the related links in the description and make sure you watch our other videos on making money and achieving financial freedom. Thanks for watching and keep striving.